Old Phuket Town is a hidden gem in Thailand's most famous island. It's a place where history comes alive. The town is a colorful tapestry of cultures. Chinese, Malay, and European influences blend seamlessly here. Walking through its streets is like stepping back in time. The air is filled with the aroma of local spices and the sound of temple bells. The town's charm lies in its well-preserved Sino-Portuguese architecture. These buildings tell stories of Phuket's tin mining boom in the 19th century. Colorful shop houses line the streets, their facades adorned with intricate designs. Ornate shrines and ancient temples add to the town's mystical atmosphere. Every corner offers a new discovery, a glimpse into Phuket's rich past. Palang Road is the beating heart of old Phuket town. It's the first stop on our journey through time. This street showcases the best of Sino-Portuguese architecture. Colorful two-story shop houses line both sides of the road. Their unique features include arched doorways and louvered shutters. Many of these buildings are over a century old. As you stroll down Palang Road, look up at the beautiful tiles on the buildings. These tiles tell stories of the families who lived here. Some buildings feature Chinese characters for good luck. Others have European-style floral motifs. The mix of styles reflects Phuket's multicultural history. It's a visual feast that photographers and history buffs will love. Palang Road is not just a historical site, it's a living, breathing part of Phuket's culture. Rosada Road offers a different flavor of old Phuket town's rich history. Walking down this road feels like stepping back in time. This street is less touristy than Talang Road, making it a hidden gem for those who seek a quieter experience. It gives visitors a more authentic glimpse into local life, where you can see residents going about their daily routines. The architecture here is a mix of old and new, reflecting the town's ability to blend tradition with modernity. You'll see traditional shop houses next to modern buildings, creating a unique and picturesque streetscape. This contrast tells the story of Phuket's evolution over time, from its early days as a trading port to its current status as a tourist destination. One of the highlights of Rosada Road is the Phuket Provincial Hall, a landmark that stands as a testament to the town's historical significance. This grand building dates back to 1907 and has witnessed many important events in Phuket's history. It's an excellent example of Sino-colonial architecture, a style that combines European and Chinese influences. The hall's white facade and green shutters are instantly recognizable, making it a favorite subject for photographers. Today, it serves as a government office, but its historical charm remains intact. But it's worth a visit just to admire its exterior and take photos, capturing a piece of Phuket's past. The manicured gardens in front offer a peaceful spot to rest, providing a serene escape from the bustling streets. Rosada Road is also home to some excellent local eateries, where you can taste the flavors of Phuket. Look for small, family-run restaurants serving authentic Phuket cuisine, each dish telling a story of its own. These flavors have been perfected over generations, offering a culinary journey that complements your exploration of Rosada Road. Don't miss the street vendors, who offer a variety of snacks and treats that are both delicious and affordable. As evening falls, Rosada Road transforms with twinkling lights, creating a magical atmosphere that invites you to linger a little longer. Occasionally, you might even catch a cultural performance, adding an extra layer of richness to your visit. The local markets are another highlight, where you can shop for unique souvenirs and experience the vibrant local culture. Rosada Road is more than just a street. It's a living, breathing part of Phuket's heritage, embodying the community spirit that makes this town so special. Phang Nga Road is where old Phuket town's artistic spirit truly shines. This street is a haven for art lovers and foodies alike. Colorful murals adorn the walls of old buildings. They tell stories of Phuket's history and culture. Street artists have transformed this area into an open-air gallery. Every turn reveals a new masterpiece waiting to be discovered. One of the most famous spots on Peng Nga Road is Soi Romani. This narrow alley is perhaps the most photogenic street in Old Town. Pastel-colored shop houses line both sides of the street. Potted plants and vintage bicycles add to its charm. Today, it's a peaceful spot perfect for a leisurely stroll or a photo op. 
Dibuk Road is a treasure trove of architectural wonders. This street showcases some of the finest examples of Sino-Portuguese buildings in Old Phuket Town. Many of these buildings once belonged to wealthy tin mine owners. Today, they stand as testaments to Phuket's prosperous past. One of the most striking buildings on Dibuk Road is the Blue Elephant Restaurant. This mansion was built in 1903 in the Sino-colonial style. Its blue exterior and white trim make it impossible to miss. The restaurant inside serves royal Thai cuisine. Even if you don't dine here, it's worth stopping to admire the architecture. The building also houses a cooking school where you can learn to make Thai dishes. Dibuk Road offers a perfect blend of history, art, and local culture. Krabi Road represents the evolving face of old Phuket town, a place where the past and present blend seamlessly. Here, you'll see how the old and new coexist harmoniously, creating a unique atmosphere that is both nostalgic and contemporary. Historic shop houses with their charming facades and rich histories stand proudly alongside modern cafes and boutiques, offering a delightful contrast. This street offers a glimpse into how Phuket is adapting to the 21st century while preserving its heritage. The preservation efforts are evident in the well-maintained buildings and the careful integration of new establishments. One of the most notable landmarks on Krabi Road is the Shrine of the Serene Light, a symbol of the town's cultural and spiritual heritage. This Chinese shrine was built in 1889 by a prominent Hokkien family, reflecting the deep-rooted Chinese influence in the area. Hidden down a small alley, it's easy to miss if you're not looking for it. Yet, those who venture down this path are rewarded with a serene and sacred space. The shrine's interior is adorned with beautiful murals and intricate carvings, each telling a story of devotion and artistry. It's a peaceful oasis in the heart of the bustling town, offering a moment of tranquility amidst the vibrant energy of Phuket. Krabi Road embodies the spirit of old Phuket town, respectful of its past, but embracing the future. It's a place where tradition and innovation walk hand in hand. It's a testament to how a historic district can evolve without losing its soul. The evolution of old Phuket town is a model for other historic areas, showing that progress and preservation can coexist beautifully. While the streets of old Phuket town are fascinating with their vibrant colors and bustling activity, there are a few hidden gems just off the main roads that shouldn't be missed. These attractions offer a deeper dive into the rich culture and history of the area. First on this list is the Phuket Tricky Museum, a place where art and imagination come to life. Located on Pung Nya Road, this museum is a favorite among both locals and tourists. This interactive art museum is a hit with visitors of all ages, offering a unique experience that blends creativity and fun. It features large-scale trompe l'oeil paintings that create stunning optical illusions, making you feel like you're part of the artwork. Visitors can pose with the artworks, creating fun and memorable photos that are perfect for sharing on social media. Another must-visit attraction is the Tai Hua Museum on Krabi Road, a place that beautifully blends history and architecture. This beautifully restored Sino-Portuguese mansion tells the story of Chinese immigration to Phuket, offering a glimpse into the past. Interactive exhibits showcase the island's rich cultural heritage and its significant tin mining history, making it an educational experience as well. For those interested in spiritual sites and seeking a moment of tranquility, a visit to Wat Mung Khan Nimit is a must. This temple offers a serene escape from the hustle and bustle of the town. This Buddhist temple is just a short walk from the long road, making it easily accessible for visitors. It's one of the oldest and most important temples in Phuket, offering a peaceful atmosphere and a deep sense of history. Whether you're a history buff, an art lover, or someone seeking spiritual solace, these attractions in old Phuket town have something special to offer. No visit to Old Phuket Town is complete without exploring its vibrant culinary scene. The town's food reflects its diverse cultural influences. Chinese, Malay, and Thai flavors blend to create unique local dishes. Street food stalls, traditional restaurants, and modern cafes offer a range of dining experiences. Each meal is an opportunity to delve deeper into Phuket's rich cultural tapestry. 
Start your culinary adventure with a traditional Phuket breakfast. Head to Wheelai Restaurant on Thalang Road for Kanom Jean. This dish consists of thin rice noodles served with various curries. For lunch, explore the local markets for authentic street food. The Lard Yai Sunday Night Market on Thalang Road is a food lover's paradise. As evening falls, treat yourself to a more upscale dining experience. One Chun Restaurant on Thepkasatri Road is known for its authentic Phuket cuisine. To make the most of your visit to old Phuket town, it's important to plan ahead. The best time to visit is between November and April. This is the dry season, with cooler temperatures and less rainfall. The town can get very hot during the day, especially from March to May. Start your explorations early in the morning or later in the afternoon to avoid the midday heat. Sun protection is crucial when walking around old Phuket town. Wear a hat, sunglasses, and apply sunscreen regularly. Many of the streets offer little shade during the day. Carry a water bottle with you to stay hydrated. Comfortable walking shoes are a must, as you'll be covering a lot of ground on foot. Respect for local customs and traditions is important when visiting Old Phuket Town.